This is a taco game of X. OGX for short. And this OGX is bad enemy review. Where I review bad enemies and show you how bad it is. Today I'm gonna review Don't Even Alone Daisy, the worst anime I have ever seen yet. This anime is so bad that all my friends that I showed this to refuse to go past episode two. I just uh, finished the whole series and I'm kind of regret granting that. Anyway, for fair warning, there gonna be some spoilers in here if you care. But you shouldn't care. Some years ago, I bought the whole series of this anime from GameStop for two whole dollars. And to this day, I still regret buying this anime. Don't leave me alone, Daisy. It's the worst anime I have ever seen so far. This anime stars Techno, a dumbass geek who spends his whole life in a bomb shelter. One day, he sees a girl on his security camera and instantly fell in love. He named her Daisy, and after that, he decided to go to school to make her his. And that starts one of the most creepiest relationships in anime. All throughout this anime, he would stalk her or try to kidnap her. He would try to kidnap her on the first episode. In the first half of this anime, it get extremely stupid. Almost as stupid as the Cell Saga. But the difference between Cell Saga and this, this actually try to take itself seriously. So you have scenes that are stupid, then turn serious, then turn stupid again. Oh man. お弁当、妙なものだったら絶対食べないからね。ねえ、これなんかすごいんだよ。僕の自信作なんだ。デイジーちゃんが好きかなと思っていっぱい詰めてきたんだ。え、何？なんだろうよこれ。Those are really stupid shit in here, like pet missiles that the main carrier has. Yes, you heard me, pet missiles. Let's show you my favorite missile, Mimi-chan. Is it a pet? Is it a pet? In the second half, they try to be a little more serious, but they even did that all wrong. Now let's talk about these bad characters. Let's start out with Techno. He is the most unlikable character I have ever seen. And I know he's been locked in the bombshell all his life. But there is no reason he should be talking like this. Some of the stuff he says is just plain stupid. Andes, he told me, or as Techno call her. Daisy, this victim you just feel so sorry for. Until the second half, when she fall in love with the stalker, and she just start acting stupid. There's X, the character in here that just get picked on, and the teacher, which is just the stupidest character I have ever seen. And there's his grandpa, a really messed up character. And there's Ani, an android created by Techno's grandfather, to watch over Techno and make sure he's okay for society. And like the rest of the characters, she is a really stupid character. The animation is just bad. There are times where the screen is just shaking, and it's just so bad. I mean, Slayers have better animations than this. And that came out in 95. Two years before this anime. The music is the only good thing about this show. And that's not saying much at all. The music is mediocre at best.
this anime is just bad in every aspect. If you see this somewhere in some bargain bin or somewhere over the internet, just avoid it. Avoid it like the plague. Unless you want to torture yourself, then go ahead, fine. I give this anime a 1 out of 10. I actually had headaches watching these episodes. I actually got a headache now. <sighs> With an aspirin. Oh, I'm out of aspirin. I gotta go to the store. 